great party, wouldn't you say? <laughs> yes. Too bad we have to leave. I could use a little more soup. What about you, Pocahontas? Do you like the soup, too? Mm. I think it's delicious. I'll have some more. I hope you will never forget our corn and chestnut soup. Don't worry, Great Chief. We'll never forget your village or your soup. <laughs> Enough soup talk. Winter is approaching, especially on the mountains. Thank you for the warning. What difficulties are in store for us, Great Chief? We have already sent a messenger ahead to tell the Shoshone that you are coming. The Grand Council of Chiefs has appointed a brave to accompany you on your journey. He is young, experienced, and courageous. One day he will be a great chief. His name is Little Fox. I will introduce you to him tomorrow. Tonight he must undergo a purification ritual. Did you say something? Hmm. Pocahontas should know I've lost the power to talk to the animals and that you don't communicate with the spirits any longer. Don't be upset. You know that one day it will all come back to us. Think so? Uh-huh. Anyway, I can tell you I miss it. I used to enjoy bragging with them. That figures as the Iroquois say, those who look alike tend to stick together. <laughs> yeah, so you won't be able to compete with us until you're as clever as they are. I gave up trying when I hit my third birthday in order not to put the other kids to shame. <laughs> Please tell me something. Do those two bicker like that all the time? No, don't get them wrong. They're only behaving like that because they want to know if they'll have their archery lessons with me or with Siwa. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> Don't mind them, Elswa. Teasing each other all the time is their idea of fun. It keeps them on their toes. Pocahontas, this is Little Fox, the brave who will accompany you. A pleasure. The pleasure is mine, Pocahontas. I've heard the chief speak so much about you. Because I bring a message from the Great Spirit. Of course. I must admit that we are very worried about you and your team. We call our mountains the Death Mountains. It is dangerous to cross them. The Pale Faces christened our land California, and these mountains, Sierra Nevada. But now we have Little Fox to guide us. We will cross the mountains safely. I'm sure of it. I hope you're right. Good luck. Have a safe journey, Pocahontas, and may the Great Spirit protect you all from danger. Because halfway up a steep cliff has killed many people trying to cross it. Luckily, I know a safe way through. There's snow up there on the peaks. Will it snow down here too? You can never tell. Let's hope not. Soup will give us strength. <sighs> Smells great, too. We must thank the Miwok for this soup. You're right, Hoppyho. The people of the Miwok village were very kind to us. Uh, what was that noise? Oh. Oh. oh, hello, Owl. It's a long time since I saw you. And you're here too, little ones. I wasn't expecting such a lovely surprise. I missed you. <laughs> it's snowing up there. Why oh. don't you ride on the buffalo's back? Here she comes, Pocahontas. Here we are. Hopi Ho's had a bright idea for once. 
What about you? Nice of you to go get what her. What are you saying? We just happen to run into each other. Will you help me get on her back, Mock? Pocahontas? Quick, undercover, it's going to snow! Where are the sacred animals? Oh, huh? It looks like they disappeared! That's impossible! A very bad sign. We must find shelter, otherwise anything could happen. But first we have to reach the crest of the mountain. That crest? It's too far away! It's no good, we'll never make it. Yes, we will, but the climb will require great courage, Pocahontas. We have lots of that. Come on, then. Still alive. Looks like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the path is blocked. We can't get through. <sighs> oh. There is a solution. Oh. Uh -huh. We found a shelter not far from here. Follow me. Join us, Pocahontas. Uh. Oh. 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 Pocahontas! What's Pocahontas. the matter? Pocahontas! <laughs> huh? oh. Thank you. You are all so kind. You see, once again, the sacred animal saved us. <laughs> oh. Now we know what the view's like from up here. <laughs> <laughs> We've made it through the mountains at last, thanks to Little Fox. Little Fox? <gasps> oh, wh what happened to him? Did he get lost? Look, there he is! <gasps> I took the wrong path because of the fog! You must have taken a shorter way, but the most important thing is, we all made it this far. The Paiuti made canoes for us to use on that river down there. Goodbye. Good luck.
You look cold, Pocahontas. You want my cape? I have my own. See? Take care, there are rabbits ahead. Watch out! You're alive! Thanks to you! Oh, Pocahontas! Pocahontas! Pocahontas, wake up! You alright? Yes. And the canoes? Mm -mm. <sighs> Pocahontas! What's happening? I'm not on the earth. Oh. Oh. Spirit, help me! I must wake up! I just saw a group of demons out there on the riverbank. Is this your idea of a joke? Go see for yourself if you don't believe me. Yes, you bet I will. Hopey ho, you better stay here with Pocahontas. I think we should go too, Hoppy Ho, don't you? I've never seen animals like those before. They're monsters. Let's Wait, get away from here and fast. Quiet. What? They're just horses. I'm positive they're horses. There's no reason for us to be afraid. I've seen them before, and I swear that when they run, they're as fast as the evening wind. These animals belong to the Spanish pale faces who live further south. Now I remember. Uh, I see them sometimes in my dreams. What's wrong? I want to say hello to them. I'm sure they're not dangerous. What are you saying? They might turn ugly when you get closer, and then what? Don't be silly. They're probably as curious about us as we are about them. You're just like the ones I see at night in my dreams. Huh? Mm -hmm. Look at how affectionate and gentle they are. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> and you thought they were a bunch of demons. Shame on you. You were scared, that's all. So they're not dangerous, but does anybody know what the Pale Faces use them for? They ride on their backs. Have you seen them do it, Hoppy Ho? Can you show us how the Pale Faces ride them? Well, I know it's not easy. So what does that mean? We can do whatever the Pale Faces do. Little Fox is right. What are we waiting for? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, that's what I call a great demonstration. Now we know what not to do. Thank you, Mark. <laughs> if you think it's so funny, how come you don't try it yourself, Hopio? <laughs> I have an idea. Pocahontas, wait here. I'm gonna get something. I'll be right back. Well, I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> So headstrong. Be patient. Hoppy Ho will be back soon. What's taking Hoppy Ho so long? There we are. It's more or less what I saw the pale faces using. You're so clever, Hoppy Ho. What do you say? Think it'll work? I hope so. If this works, we can teach the others. on horseback. Huh? What? I am Red Owl. Oh. I belong to the Pierced Nose tribe. I have been sent by my tribe and the Shoshone to accompany you to the meeting place. Welcome, Red Owl. Thank you for coming to meet us. Our tribes have been waiting impatiently for you, Pocahontas. Your horse is so well equipped. Why is that? A great chief from the south took four horses from the Spanish Pale Faces and gave one to my friend, Thundering Falcon, son of the great Shoshone chief. We hope to get more soon. Our warriors can cover great distances on horseback. 
what about you? Where did you get your horses from? They were waiting for us after we came across the mountains. We think they're a gift from the Great Spirit. Yes, a gift from the Great Spirit. I believe our people should have more and more horses, don't you agree? Yes, I'm sure they will be excellent companions for braves from all the tribes.